Yes, sir. I look like that. Uh, in from Canada? Yep. Stand up for me, Mario. Good. Good. Okay, you have a cane, right? Yes, I do. The idea is for you to leave here without a cane? You do. Hopefully. Okay, come on into the room. I'll grab your bag. Okay, so you're holding on. You can't stand up straight. No. All right, you're leaning forward, yeah. swollen wrist. You got injections or a wound here? Yeah, I got a wound there. I had uh, bursitis, so they, they uh, cut it open. So you had bursitis, so they cut his arm open. Yeah, <laughs> and I got uh, really bad arthritis in my leg, all swollen up, and I got uh, uh, most of my pain. The pain just killed me all the way up my back okay. to my hip. And you cannot stand up? No. Okay. Six inch scar, how long ago? Well, about four years now. Four years ago. One disc or two? Two. Two discs. All right. Thank you, Mario. And then? Uh, Woo! Doctor, carry on. I know. Carry on, doctor. Oh, inch, inch short. Two. It was two. It was two. Well, now it's in about just over an inch short. Right left, right short. Uh, okay. Pain when you flex his knees? Yeah. Okay. Where was the pain? Well, my hip, right here. Point to it. Right here. Right sacroiliac, okay. Uh, Stays right short as well. All right, can you turn your head to the right? Now do the flexion, knee flexion. Uh, still painful? A uh, little bit less, yeah. Okay, still, now? Still right short. Still right short. Turn your head to the left. Can you bring him down and bring him up again, Dr. Blue? Right short, stays right short, less pain? Yeah, a lot less. A lot less in left cervical rotation indicates his left occiput is tied into his sacrum causing some low back pain. And leg length deficiency. So that's a non-compensatory finding that has to be... As he's holding it, right. his legs started to balance. Exactly. So he does have a positive deer field with left rotation. Okay, explain that to them. Explain that. You think innate intelligence is... Yes, innate intelligence is working. Left positive cervical rotation, meaning that as he turns his head to the left, the ligaments that attach the skull to the sacrum are being pulled, and innately his body wants his head to turn left to get out of the pain. So his head's stuck in a right rotation. Okay, so now, what do we adjust first? Skull. Okay, boca arriba, por favor. Next phase, major correction by Dr. Roger. Now I wanna let Frank get up and just walk around any way he wants, incorrect. Because of his misalignment for years and years and years, the brain, okay, knows a certain way and the memory is burned into the brain where he has to walk a certain way. So when he gets up, no different than a golf swing, you had a back golf swing, you go practice, you have the, you, you, no matter how many lessons you take, the thing that's burned in, you have that same bad golf swing, you have to correct it. Well, with him, he's bad, the gait has been wrong, the walk, and he's been favoring it. Most important, all your patients, after you do this correction, okay, you make them go out and walk in the hallway, 30 to 50 steps front and backwards without limping. No matter how hard it hurts, it'll be a phony hurt. It's the brain saying it hurts, but really it's because of its memory, not because it's really happening. Trust me on this one, extremely important. Okay, and we're gonna Sounds do that good. now. Come with me. Rotate your feet in. Don't make my leg down. Take care. Take them in. Have a great day now. Okay. So don't bring your camera here. Try. Here we go. Keep going. Come on. Oh. Let's go backwards. No, the family reunion. Okay, we took a walk, as you saw. Now, he's specifically pointing at L5 on the right, L4 on the right where the old fusion is four years ago, and when I pushed here, oh. it caused radiation to pain the right leg. Oh. So we're gonna have the whole area shifted by putting our contact point at L4, L5, but doing a scissors maneuver by bringing it down on, on the right side. Oh. 
to help us out, we're going to put a wedge under here on the right. Give bring little, the target closer to you. Bring, bring it in. Put your piece of form right on elf yeah. on the bimulary process here. And it's a scissors lift, assisted drop again. That's a beautiful, beautiful adjustment. Move. It moved right in, didn't it? Yeah, it moved right in. We're going to come up to L4. That was beautiful. We're going to grab that L4. We're going to do the same thing. Uh. Caught them both. Wow. How's that feel, Frankie? Oh, so far it feels a lot better. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's way better. Oh, yeah. Uh. This is an occipital sacral release. The most important thing in here is the communication between the sacrum and the occiput. Very, it's very, very, very confirmed, very direct, very specific, can't deny it. By, op by opening up the sacrum, opening up the occiput, you free up the spinal cord and you get a m nice coordinated movement between occiput and sacrum. When you do the occiput, you don't do it, you don't push hard, you, you tap it, right? Assisted yep. release, Dr. Roger, boom, okay? Or you hurt somebody. All right? Now. Uh, I don't want more pain, I want less pain. All right, Frankie, go ahead and sit up, please. Oh, yeah, nice. Couldn't do that. Before. Oh, that feels good. You, you just got up off the table. Could you have not have done that? No. No. Before I came, no. I would have to get assistance. I would have got a lot of help to get up like that. Okay, stand okay. up for me. Mario's filming you. Oh, yeah, like I still have pain, but not like before. Like I still so have... We're going to now work on you all week, and we're going to teach you how to walk again. Deal? Good. Oh, yeah. Are you happy? Done. Yes, I'm so far. Yeah, so far. I love you, buddy. I love you guys. Doc. Hey. Thanks for coming in. Oh, thank you guys. I appreciate it. All right, it's better. I hope. Oh, it's good. It's what I want to hear. You came in here. You're not faking. You flew in from Canada, correct? Yeah, that's correct. Flew in from Canada. Miserable pain. Crawls into the office with a cane. All right? Yeah. Every movement was painful. You just got here today. You just had a 10-minute GPA realignment with the guru, Dr. Roger. How do, how do you feel? Uh, I feel amazing. From when I came in, like Dr. Tenzi was saying, I, could, I couldn't walk. I had pain just thrusting all, all, all day long from morning to night. And as soon as he started doing it, like, I really feel fantastic. I don't know. Words. I've been waiting two years for this, walking with my cane. Doc, and I love you guys. You guys are the best. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Okay. Yeah, Way to go, Frankie! Oh, this Roger, look what so you far. did, man. Look at that. Oh. No cane. That looks nice. No, no cane. cane. Walks in with the cane, walks out without a cane. A bit of pain, but no cane. That's a